The park bridge on the Trans-Canada Highway has a span of 405 meters, reaching a height of 90 meters, high above the Kicking Horse River. It was a major upgrade to the highway which sees a large amount of traffic and is a critical transportation link, seeing about 10,000 vehicles daily, of which 25% on average is heavy trucks transporting goods. The project took three years to complete, starting in 2004 until 2007, and cost $130 million. The final phase, Phase 4, was just completed in 2024. The longest single span on the bridge is 80 meters or 260 feet long. Before this upgrade, the highway was a slow, windy, single lane in each direction, clinging to the cliffside. Forty years prior, in the Golden Star, these locals had these comments about the improvement that was needed for this treacherous stretch of road. In 1881, the Canadian Pacific Railway decided to use this route for the railroad, and it was completed in 1885. These historical photos are from sometime in the 1890s. A lot has changed in 140 years, but you can still see the rugged nature of the canyon. Today, we cruise by in our modern vehicles at 100 kilometers an hour, while suspended 300 feet up on pillars of concrete and steel, a feat of engineering. <laughs>